I went from condos to pops house on calls now bus routes and the one person who had the key to my heart took it and checked out I don't know if people were I definitely recognize you know is is is, is bringing up your weight loss man uh talk about that because a lot of people especially from our community need to like you know hear about some of the things you did because okay. that's a problem when it comes to health in our yeah, community of course. so if you could speak on like what did you do to like you know get your weight loss going um basically what I did was like to get my weight down I, I've been a pescatarian for seven years if you don't know what a pescatarian is it's basically you eat fish and shrimp you don't eat no chicken no pork no beef nothing no turkey nothing of that nature you know what I'm saying wow. so back when I became a pescatarian I doubled up on bread rice shit like that potatoes and you know that starch is not good for you so I became in 2019 uh, 2018 in December I was I was the biggest I ever been in my life I was two I was three I was 349, 349, 350. You know, that's the biggest I ever been, but you gotta understand I was on a roll. I was eating what I want, McDonald's, all Waffle Houses, just doubling up. I'll get hungry, I'm eating two plates, three plates, whatever. I made it even eat, you know what I'm saying? Somebody. You know what I mean? So I would just like just eating to eat. You know what I'm saying? I didn't need to. So that 2019 came, I'm like, damn, I gotta trickle down. So I just like slowed down. I was eating these meals from Mama Lena's called the Fat Boy Special. So yeah. basically it was like some salmon, some broccoli, and um mashed potatoes or something. I was like salmon, broccoli, and uh like soft plantains. That's like um uh bananas and shit like that. So I was eating that. So by the time that so gradually by the summer Cause I was going on tour, my first tour for my album called Tyreek. I was going on tour in September. So by September, I was 280. Wow. I was 280. So mind you, in December, I'm like, damn, how did I lose? I damn near lost 70 pounds or some shit like that. I was 280 in September. Wow. Mind you, that last December, I was just 369. I'm like, yeah. damn, how I do this? But then I was with my wife, and then my daughter was conceived in around... That September I was 280 My daughter was conceived Around February 2020 You know what I'm saying And then by that time Like the pandemic hit I was in the house You know what I mean We was eating and shit like that Weaning stencil and all That's when I had moved to Cali We was eating weaning stencil I was going to Jack in the Box I was going to Del Taco We was eating pizza And shit like that yeah, So yeah. I got back to like Damn near 300 you know what I'm saying? I got back down like 300. So I'm like, damn, bro, I'm 296 right now. So then I was just like, the 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 summer of 2021, I'm like, nah, it's over. Yeah, I'm going to change yeah, it up. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. I just switched it up. And then I, I got down. By the time November came in 2021, I was 240. Yeah. Wow. That's amazing, man. And I can tell you definitely all the way down right now, yeah, man. So fact. that's dope. So right now, I'm like, what, 250? Last time I got on the scale, I was like 260. But it's water weight, though, because at the yeah. end of the day, I just weighed myself like four days ago. I was 250. Mm. I'm like, bro, it's water weight. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. it, it can't be that I'm gaining, like, you know, 10 pounds in four days. No, yeah, it's yeah. water weight. You know what I'm saying? At least you're not over that three, though. You no, know what I'm saying? Hell no, I would never that. get back to that three. I'm all, yeah. I put on the sweat bag quick. <laughs> Fuck that. I, I put on the sweat bag quick and drop eight pounds so just so I can see it on the scale. Yeah, yeah. I just want to see it on the scale. Yeah, that, I'm, yeah. that I'm like, you know, within my <laughs> means. Because I've been 250 now. I've been like 250, 240, shit like that. Yeah. For like two years. Two, yeah. three years now. Two years. Dope. Yeah. Man, that's what's up. That's what's up. You know, another positive thing, man, that I just want to, you know, shout out and point out myself because I respect it, man, is that you one of the ones that are out there that, you know, uh, uh, it's open with, uh, you know, uh, having pictures with your wife and your kids yeah. and everything like that. You know, um, that's the way that I think more black men should do it. When you have family, show family. Yeah. You know, that's our problem. We always want to show yeah. our, by ourselves. We don't want to put our family out there. But show your family, yeah, man. Of more of us need to see that. So what made you be so open to, like, showing your family and letting people into because that Because look, look, look who we used to deal with back in the day. Not look who we used to deal with back in the day, but look at the shows back in the day. Family Matters. Yeah, Parenthood. Yeah. yeah. The Fresh Prince of Bel Air, you know what I'm saying? Shit like that. Uh, what else? Jamie Foxx show. What? What? What's all? What's what was all that coronating uh, coronate to? Yeah. Family. That's what we doing. I'm doing family. That's it. You know what I'm saying? No matter what me and my wife go through in life, we always gonna make sure our kids know it was family. It's it's family. It was family. It's gonna be family. It's family. Always make sure the if the family feud nobody eats. Uh -huh. If the family feud nobody wins. You know what I'm saying? So 
that's where we big we big on my wife come from a big family I come from a nice size family you know what I'm saying yeah. so at the end of the day it's all about family we all we got you know what I'm saying no matter how much we fight argue scratch each other whatever the kid is family we we gotta we gotta help each other no matter if we don't want to we still got to you know what I'm saying now people cross the bridge that they can't come back from ah right, yeah the hell with them you know what I'm saying it's nothing you can do because you cross you cross the major bridge that you wasn't supposed to cross I mean you cross this bridge we probably fought bit you you bit me whatever they can but now you cross this bridge there's no turning back I wash my hands with you let God deal with you fuck you Man. you know what I mean but if we but if we can mend the fence and just come together and be family for real and you I got your back you got my back with no intentions that's what's family about I had to show